Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Practice with Music on my channel. So for today's reaction, we're going to be reacting to the real reason why Kendall Jenner shared with Selena Gomez. But before we get started, you guys already know the drill. Do not forget to hit the subscribe button down below. Do not forget to comment down below uh, what are your thoughts on this video. Follow me on my social media platforms, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, and TikTok. The links will be in the, in the description box down below. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for your love and support. Thank you for being a real OG. I truly, truly appreciate you. And yeah, let's get started. Kendall Jenner recently found herself in hot water after shading Selena Gomez, and Selenators were quick to call her out. In case you don't know, Selena and Kendall actually used to be close, but grew apart after Kendall started hanging out with Selena's ex, Justin Bieber, behind Selena's back. But this was years ago, and you would think that whatever bad blood Selena and Kendall had going on between them, they would have gotten over it by now. So is Kendall really being petty and trying to reignite the feud with Selena for no reason? Once upon a time, Selena Gomez and and Kendall Jenner were part of the same girl squad. More precisely, they were part of the famous Taylor Swift squad. Selena and Taylor met all the way back in 2008 when they both dated the Jonas Brothers. Taylor was dating Joe while Selena was- Wow, that was back in the days. I was so young, that one I remember. Dating Nick. And although those relationships didn't last for too long, Selena and Taylor's friendship survived. As for Kendall, she used to be a big time Taylor fan since she was a teen, and she even filmed a video with her sister Kylie for Taylor's song, Better Than Revenge. Mind you, in Better Than Revenge, Taylor sings about a girl who stole her boyfriend, and Taylor reportedly wrote it about Camilla Bell, who dated Taylor's ex, Joe Jonas. In hindsight, it's interesting that Kendall made a video lip syncing to Better Than Revenge, since years later, she kind of did exactly what Taylor wrote the song about. She started hanging out with Taylor's ex, Styles. Back in 2016, it was reported that Taylor was furious at Kendall for getting close to Harry, who briefly dated Taylor in 2012. A source told Hollywood Life at the time that Taylor heard from a mutual friend that Harry and Kendall are back together and she is completely shocked. She can't believe that Kendall would actually date Harry, especially after their last conversation when she said she would never ever get involved with him again. The source also added that Taylor and Kendall actually bonded over dissing Harry and comparing notes on him, which is why Taylor felt completely betrayed by Kendall when she found out the model was hanging out with Harry. So mm -hmm. is this Kendall's MO? Does she like to get involved with her friend's boyfriends? Right. Well, that's what the Selenators are saying, because Taylor wasn't the only girl Kendall stabbed in the back in this way. Before the whole Harry Styles situation, Kendall did the same thing to Selena when she was caught sneaking around. Yeah, there's a problem. There's a pattern. We've seen the pattern, right? There's a pattern brown with selena's then boyfriend justin bieber in september 2014 justin was spotted having a one-on-one -on -one dinner with kendall in paris while selena was also in town apparently justin lied to selena about meeting kendall and told her he was going to have dinner with his security team at this point justin and selena had already broken up and made up several times so it didn't take long before selena's old trust issues came bubbling to the surface and the pair broke up again in october 2014 Daily Mail reported at the time that Selena was absolutely furious that Kendall would betray her like this. Justin and Selena had traveled to the city of love together, and on the night Justin met Kendall, he was supposed to attend the CR fashion book party with Selena. However, Selena somehow caught wind of Justin and Kendall's intimate dinner, and according to a source who spoke to In Touch Weekly, she went crazy when she realized Justin had lied to her face. As she should. Why lie? Selena was absolutely livid when she found out Justin had dinner with Kendall. He lied to her about it, the source said. She was so angry that she changed her flight to come back to LA two days early and told him the relationship was over again. Later that night, Justin was seen at the CR fashion book party chatting it's funny how they say it again. and taking photos with Kendall, Kris Jenner, Kim Kardashian, as well as one of Kendall's BFFs, Gigi Hadid, while Selena kept her distance and refused to take photos with Justin. Oh, and by the way, Kendall decided to wear a very similar outfit to Selena's that night. Coincidence? Maybe. But considering Kendall's latest attempt to throw shade at Selena, anything is possible. As Us Weekly reported at the time, Selena didn't trust Kendall's motives because Kendall had reportedly sent texts to Justin 
telling him he should hang out with her, which further angered Selena. Apparently, Selena was on holiday with Justin in St. Martin shortly before their Paris trip when she saw text messages on Justin's phone from Kendall asking him to hang out. Selena had previously also cut ties with Kendall's sister Kylie when she found out Kylie too tried to hang out with Justin behind Selena's back. According wow. to Radar Online, Kylie sent sexy pics of herself to Justin, and when Selena saw the pictures on Justin's phone, she freaked out. To make matters worse, wow. the Jenner sisters started all this drama shortly after they attended the Coachella Music Festival with Selena. A source later told it How convenient. How convenient. Mm. In Touch Weekly that Justin and Kendall's secret dinner in Paris wasn't the first time the pair hung out behind Selena's back. And it turned out, Justin had been texting Kendall the whole time. Justin admitted it and insisted they're just friends. But Selena didn't believe him and they had a screaming match over it. She felt completely humiliated, the source added. Meanwhile, a separate insider close to the Kardashian-Jenners revealed that Kendall actually enjoyed the fact that she could come between Selena and Justin. Kendall just loves that she got something over on Selena, the source explained. It's ugly behavior. So what is Kendall's problem? Why would she enjoy coming between her friends and their boyfriends? Well, whatever her reasons are, it seems like Kendall is still trying to come at Selena because she was recently caught throwing shade at the singer on Twitter. The drama started when Kendall shared a series of photos on Instagram of her celebrating Easter with her family while wearing the same pink floral dress Selena wore in her music video for De Una Vez. The dress was made by celebrity favorite designer duo Rodart for their new spring slash summer 2021 collection, so it's not that unusual that two high-profile women decided to wear the same designer dress. The director of Selena's music video actually explained that Selena's look was inspired by Mexican painter Frida Kahlo and added that the flowers on the dress, hair, and within the video all connect with this idea of renewal and represent healing and growth. So the drama wasn't really about Selena and Kendall having the same taste in dresses, but rather about the shady comment Kendall made after her fan account on Twitter shared her IG photos with the caption. Wow. That just looks smack alike. Kendall Jenner pulling off this dress better than anyone else. Kendall then reshared the post and added, had to take it home from set. The Selenators immediately took the. Yeah, that was shade. I don't care. I don't care. That was shade as direct shade towards Selena, and it didn't take them long before they started calling out Kendall. Although Kendall quickly deleted her shady tweet after receiving backlash from Selena's fans, celebrity news account Pop Faction had already managed to grab a screenshot and repost it. Period. So how did the Selenators react to Kendall shading Selena? Well, Selena's official Twitter fan club had an equally shady response to the drama. They reposted Kendall's tweet with photos of the model wearing the dress and encouraged fans to stream Selena's new Spanish language EP. The caption simply read, stream hashtag revelacion. The post quickly received thousands of likes and retweets, and the Selenators jumped at the opportunity to call out Kendall for being petty. One of mm -hmm. Selena's fans laughed at the tweet about Kendall pulling off the dress better than anyone, and wrote, Kendall Jenner, I swear to you that you don't look better than Selena Gomez in that dress. Another angry Selenator added, Kendall needs to remember she's only famous because of her last name. Selena made a name for herself since she was a kid. Kendall looks like a whole clown being shady. However, Kendall's fandom fired back and called the Selenators dramatic for making a big deal over a dress. One person tweeted, Toxic Selenators, not everyone revolves around Selena. Mature once and for all. Another Twitter user told the Selenators to shut up and added, Selena doesn't own the dress, so why do you care so much? No one is saying Kendall looked better in it. We're just saying she looks stunning, but that doesn't mean Selena can't have looked great too. But for Selenators, it's not really about the dress or who wore it better. First of all, Selena wore the dress in the video for not just any song, but the song her fans believe she wrote about her relationship with Justin. Selena described the song De Una Vez, which translates to At Once, as a beautiful love anthem. And thematically, the lyrics describe the process of healing after a relationship and finding strength in being alone. So as Selena's fans pointed out, the real issue with Kendall's tweet is that not only does Kendall have a history with Selena's ex, Justin, but she's also close friends with Justin's wife, Haley, which makes her con- That I didn't know. She's close with Haley? Oh no.
Snake, snake, snake. Comment even shadier. As one Selenator put it, the thing is not that no one can wear the dress. The thing is that Kendall is a friend of her ex and his wife, who also was rumored to hook up with Justin Bieber. So yeah, that's the point. I'm sure Kendall knew what she's doing and what the reaction will be. So now I want to know how you feel about this drama. Did Kendall really try to shape Selena on purpose, or did the Selenators blow this way out of proportion? Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. I personally feel like, um, yes, she did shit on purpose. Like, yes, she did. Y'all let me know what y'all think down below in the comments. I want to hear what you guys think. Also, once again, thank you so much for watching this video. If you got to the end, you are a real one. And let me know what other type of videos you would like me to react to next. I'll make sure I do so for you guys. Um, thank you so much for the new subscribers. I appreciate you guys. Welcome to the G-Squad family. And I'll catch you guys on my next one. See ya.